Yo! What's good, everybody? It's Monday. So we got some new content today in 2K. We got new triple threat rewards offline and online. And you guys see the title of the stream, so y'all know what's going on. We're gonna play some triple threat offline today. Y'all know I never got Ron Boone, so hopefully 2K feels bad for me and gives me Louis Dampier early. And y'all know I love triple threat online. Probably my favorite game mode in the game, even though I don't love the 100. I don't know, I just enjoy playing it, so I think later in the week, maybe tomorrow on a stream, we'll go for this man, ML Carr. I played over 100 games this season, so yeah, I'm gonna play a lot of games to go for him. Hopefully, I get him, because I was able to get Gus Gerard pretty easily. I have an extra Gus Gerard right here, so we're gonna play Triple Threat online later in the week. I can already guarantee you that, but y'all know this is personal for me, man. I never got Ron Boone. I don't know what it was, but it's like 2K just didn't want to give me Ron Boone this week, man. Not just this week, but last week, the week before, we just never got Ron Boone. So hopefully we have better luck going for this guy, Louis Dampier. He actually looks really good. Like his stats, his badges, they all look pretty great. So hopefully we can get Louis Dampier. Hopefully we can also get ML Carr later in the week. Yeah. Pretty cool stuff going on in Triple Threat offline and online. So today we're starting off on the offline side of things. And yeah, we're gonna play some online later in the week for sure. Let's go ahead and get things started, man. No need for me to delay any longer. Of course, I'm not gonna use this team right here. This team I have right here is pretty good, so let me put together a different team. I already know who I wanna use. Let's get Corey Kispert in there. Let's replace Ibaka and Glenn Robinson. Let's get a fast point guard in there, like Trey Young. And of course, let's get our center in there. Doesn't even matter who we use. Let's use a bad team, and let's win every game. We're gonna play a lot of games today. We're gonna win a lot of games today. Let's get right to it, ladies and gentlemen. What's up, Kendall? Kavan? Jamari? Nobody you know? Dean of Dubai? Doc Adams? Hawkeye, Miami Heat champions. Hey, today was the Miami Heat media day. I'm pretty sure you knew that, but yeah. Just pointing that out. What's up, Militant? Miami Heat, Hokachevsky, Richard, Callum. You guys say what's up to me in the chat if you haven't already. And let me know what y'all think of today's new content. I mean, it's nothing insane, nothing crazy, but new players in the game is always a pretty cool thing. New vault reward. New top board reward. What do y'all think of this new content, man? Because personally, I like it. I've heard both players are really good. Louis Dampier looks great, and I've heard the ML Carr might be the best defensive player in the entire game. So, yeah, ML Carr, I'm 100% gonna go for him later this week. Maybe tomorrow. On Tuesdays, we always get new content, but y'all know I'm not big on opening packs. I open packs every now and then, but yeah. Tomorrow's new content's gonna be pretty much purely packs. So, yeah, I've heard ML's pretty good. I'll go for him later in the week. Dallas said, yo, Doc, what's up, Dallas? Welcome to the stream. Also, what's up, Josh? Yeah, we're gonna win a lot of games today. We didn't get Ron Boone, so I'm really, really hoping that 2K gives us some better luck today. Like, my fingers are crossed. 2K better have mercy on me. They better feel bad for me. But no guarantees, no promises. What's up, WMV Shots? What's up, Kevin? Kevin said it's always fun when Doc does a stream and uploads. Speaking of uploading, I hope you guys enjoyed the video this weekend. It was a pretty fun video. I was gonna post two videos, but I don't know. I was in the middle of editing a video and I was like, eh, this ain't it, so. I refilmed it today and it turned out a hundred times better. So, yeah, No Money Spent episode is gonna drop on probably Wednesday, maybe tomorrow. I seriously don't know. It depends on how much I feel like editing tonight. We'll have to see. But yeah. So, hope you guys enjoyed the video on, I think it was Saturday. And yeah, I got some more videos in store for you guys this week. I recorded one today. I'm gonna record another one probably tomorrow morning. 
One video is gonna drop probably Wednesday, the other one probably Thursday, and then of course, we always enjoy streaming on Friday. What's up Josh? Jessica? What's up Yoke? King Jess? Jessica said, do great like you always do. Hey, I will do my best. Miami Heat said, drop no money spent today. I refilmed it. That's the video I was going to refilm. So, I refilmed it this morning because the last episode, it wouldn't have been trash or anything. But, I don't know. I just didn't feel... I just don't know, man. It wasn't the way I wanted it to be. It would have been a fun video, but I just had to reshoot it at a... It's tough to explain, man. But you guys are going to enjoy the next episode. I guarantee it's probably going to be on Wednesday. Maybe tomorrow, though. We'll have to see. CP the Doc said, my best card is Ruby Terrence Ross. I suck. Ruby Terrence Ross isn't bad, though. But yeah, you could definitely get some better cards on the auction house. Save up some MT and yeah, try to buy some better cards on the auction house with MT. Maybe, you know, get the players out of the vault, play some triple threat online, play some domination. There's a lot of ways to get diamond amethyst players that, you know, are better than Terrence Ross. Even though Terrence Ross is a pretty good budget player. Josh said, how long do you think the stream is going to be? So, either the stream is going to be, you know, a few hours long. Or, I'll end the stream after I get Dampier. I want to get Dampier today. And maybe get ML Car tomorrow, so I don't know how long it's gonna take today, but if it's like two hours in and then we get Dampier, I'll probably end the stream right there. But if we don't get Dampier after two hours, I might, you know, cap at like let's say four or five hours. So it's not gonna be a short stream, but it's not gonna be as long as my, you know, domination grinds and stuff like that. If I had to estimate, I'd say somewhere between three and five hours. Feels good to get back and grind the game. Hey, what's up, Bobovin? Welcome to the stream. What's up, Veretta? Jericho said, what's good? What's up, Jericho? Wyatona said, I sniped some diamond contracts for 22k. I'm gonna hold them until value rises more. Dude, you just reminded me. Earlier today, I got a diamond contract. I was playing Triple Threat online. And I was in a rush, I guess. I accidentally put one of my diamond contracts on Serge Ibaka. It was terrible. I gave Serge Ibaka a diamond contract. Serge Ibaka's not bad. He's one of the best centers in the game right now. But dude, that is such a waste of a diamond contract. Diamond contracts, they're going for around 20k. So I basically threw away 20k MT because I accidentally gave a contract to Ibaka. Ibok is no scrub, but that's such a waste. Bobovin said another goaded triple threat offline grind. Hopefully they bless you. The car looks great. Dude, Dampier is looking like one of the best offensive point guards in the game. He's not even terrible defensively. He's got like 90 perimeter. Not sure if he has clamps, but I mean, he looks great defensively. Offensively, he looks absolutely great. He's got like a 90 ball handle. I want to say a 92 three point shot. 92 speed and man he's got some great attributes and both players ML Carr and Dampier have great badges. Dampier is better offensively, ML Carr is better defensively. ML might be the best defensive player in the game. Austin K said hey doc what's the deal with pink diamond Glenn Robinson? He has an 83 three ball. An 83 isn't bad though I mean I have players who have like a 79, 83 point shot, and if you can just time the release, an 80 is consistent enough. Like, I know it's not great, but it's good enough for Glenn Robinson. His release is cash. If you've seen my No Money Spent videos, you know Glenn Robinson is shooting the lights out. Hey, what's up, Crazy GC? Welcome to the stream. What's up, Paul? What's up, Pearl Man? Royal Brayden said Dampier is small, but that doesn't really matter at this point in the year. Facts, man. Small guards, they can shoot over big men. They're super fast, they can get to the rim. Dampier, offensively, is a top point guard in the game. Is he the top point guard? I don't know, but he's definitely, I'd say, top five. What's up, McQuar? What's up, Master85s? 
Welcome to the stream, both of y'all. Jessica said, just dropped a like. Love you, Doc. Hey, you guys follow Jessica's example. Drop a like on the stream for me if you haven't already. We're just getting started. And I can already tell y'all this is going to be a good grind. Drop a like on the stream. Talk to me in the chat. Let me know you're here. We're going to play a lot of games offline today. And we're going to do the online stuff later this week. Y'all know I like playing online. Good shot. Bobovin said shooting stats don't matter as much this year. It's so easy to green. That's true. I agree with that. I 100% agree. I feel like even with players who have like a low 73 ball, I'm still able to green. In draft mode, you use a lot of guys who have low three balls, but as long as it's good enough, as long as, you know, you're able to time the shot, you should be fine. An 83 three ball is actually pretty elite. It's not, you know, top tier like... 90 95 but if you have an 85 three ball that is good enough if you have like an 83 ball that's good enough to be honest Bobovin said I'm so mad I didn't get Corey Kispert I flat out forgot to do the challenge dude who saw my video Corey Kispert went crazy in that video if you just drive in kick out to him he's green he has such a fast easy jump shot and of course he can't dribble, he's not amazing defensively, he's not gonna dunk on you or anything crazy like that, but my gosh, like dude, Corey Kispert is just, he's an insane shooter. Braden said, I got Kispert last second, dude, I'm telling you, I'm telling you man, Kispert, 100% worth it, super fun player, with a surprisingly good shot, even though I missed that one. JC, JGC said, oh, we got a JW raid incoming. That's my guy. I didn't even know he was live. Welcome to the stream, Jay. I saw you playing versus Codeine the other day, if I'm not mistaken. What's up, Jay? What's up, JW fan? Yeah, we got a raid incoming. We're just getting started, but we already got a raid. 454 Gaming, JW fan, Jay. Welcome to the stream, everybody coming from the raid. Y'all talk to me in the chat. Let me know how you're doing. I know JW himself's gonna come through pretty soon. And there's my chat getting hyped. Dean Wade, Miami Heat. Yeah, there's the chat getting hyped. Yeah, shout out to my boy, JW coming through. Good pass, good shot. Master85 said I missed it too. I was gonna do it today, yeah, so, I really do hate to say this, I really hate to say this, but if you want Corey Kispert, I'm not sure if you'll ever be able to get him again, I want to say that maybe you will be able to at some point, maybe at the end of the season they'll bring him back, but, yeah, Corey Kispert, y'all might have missed your chance if you didn't get him this weekend. A Honest Weethel fan, we also got Clutch Boston, A welcome to the stream everybody who's coming from JW. Shout out to that man right there. That goat. And there's JW himself. He said, what's up, everyone? What's good, JW? Welcome to the stream, my man. Thank you for the raid. We're just getting started. We are just firing up, so... That is a great way to get this stream cooking. Shout out to JW for showing love. Always. Good shot by Kispert. Kispert, I don't know if he's missed yet. He's missed, like... Maybe one shot, but I'm telling you, Kispert is just that dude. Oreo Cookie said, imagine he gets it next game. That would be awesome. Just a short, chill live stream. Then again, the title of this stream isn't anything crazy like streaming until I get Louis Dampier. We'll probably play some online if I get Dampier early. Cholo said, what up? What's up, Cholo? Welcome to the stream. JW said, I'm good. How's the grind going? It's been good so far, man. It's been good. It's been fun so far. How was your stream? Good board. Hey, there's my man. Lakers Magic. A little bit late to the raid, but still coming through. Shout out to you. Ah, they're playing good defense on the corners now. 
Not good enough for Kispert, though. Braden said locker code. Oh, new locker code? I don't think Braden will lie about that. So, new locker code. I might put it in after this game. What's it for? The E Money said CP the God. What's good, my man? What's up, man? Welcome to the stream. We're just chilling, knocking down threes, zooming through these games. Soren said, hey, Doc, I got an 87 on my physics today. Nice. 87 on physics. That's what I'm talking about. Oh, I didn't mean to shoot that. That's very good, though. Sean said, sub to this man. I agree with Sean. You guys should definitely sub if you haven't already. We're less than, I think, 60 subs away from 22,000, so our grind continues. Maybe we can get 22k by the end of the month. I don't know. Trevor said, yo, what's up, Trevor? Good defense. Doc Adams said, new 2K22 banner for a banner in my career. That's not even a my team code. That's tough. I thought there was going to be a code for a free pack, a free diamond contract, something crazy like that. But yeah, I'm not even going to pin that code. That's not even cool. But it is new. It is new. It is a new code, but I'm not going to pin that. To be fair, I haven't really played much my career. Good pass. Good shot. Trevor said 87 on physics. Damn. I just got a 44 on a math quiz. Nice. Not for real, though. 44 is tough. 44 is tough. This is why I tell you guys to study instead of watching the streams. Nah, I'm kidding, though. I appreciate y'all for supporting me, but bounce back next time, man. Bounce back. Make at least a 60 on the next quiz. That'll average out to over a 50. Miami Heat said, I got a 92 in math. Trevor said, I sleep in math class. I'm right with you on that one. To be fair, though, I haven't taken math in four years. I haven't taken like, actual math in four years. Of course, I was a neuroscience major. Neuroscience and broadcasting double major. So there's a lot of math involved with some sciences. Chemistry is the first one that comes to mind, but yeah. I haven't taken real math in so long because I did well on my AP exams, so yeah. I haven't had to worry about math since. I've just been chilling ever since. JW said, I got the flu. I can't go college tomorrow. That's why I'm here at 10 p.m. I didn't realize it was 10 p.m. your time. I didn't even realize it was 10 p.m. for you. Man, you're a real one for dropping by then. To be fair, I see you in here all the time. I hope you get better though, man. ASAP. AK said, yo, what's up, AK? Trevor said, I take chemistry this year. It's light work. There's so much math involved in chemistry, man. I think if you didn't sleep during math class, you'd be fine. Then again, just because you made 44 on a quiz doesn't mean your semester's over. You'll be fine. It's one quiz. At least it's not a test. You're gonna be all right. Hey, what's up, Eli? Welcome to the stream. What's up, my Celtics Blue? It. He said, I played at least 20 games without the vault opening one time. Are you serious? That's tough, man. I've opened the vault almost every time, but we haven't gotten anything great yet. We've gotten tokens, and we've gotten a standard pack. We just got gold Bill Cartwright out of the pack, so yeah. We haven't gotten anything great yet. And of course, I never got Ron Boone, so my vault luck in these first couple weeks of 2K22 has just been non-existent. Nikhil said it's 3 a.m. here. I came in the stream a couple days ago. I remember that. 3 a.m., that's crazy. Bonus time said, what's up, Doc? What's up, bonus time? Welcome to the stream. What's up, unknown ball legend? Ball Legend said, are you going to be streaming later? I'll be back. Depends on how much later you mean, but 
Most likely, yes. I don't think this stream is going to be too long, but I do want to go until I get him. Or four hours, whichever one comes first. Good shot. Braden says, why is the AI cracked all the time? Great question, man. I don't know why 2K decided to make the CPUs insane this year. I don't know. I guess it is more of a challenge, which I like, though. Hey, Stygian. That's a long name. Thank you for the sub. And welcome to Doc Nation. You guys make sure to subscribe if you haven't already. I think that's our first new sub of the stream. Well, the first one that's shown up on the screen. Richard said, yo, Doc, I'll be back. Sounds good. Sounds good to me. Go do what you gotta do. Trisha said, I had a random Nets player in my collection. He sold for 3.9 thousand. I know Spencer Dinwiddie's going for like 5,000. I sold my Spencer Dinwiddie for like over 5,000. So if it was Dinwiddie, I'm not surprised. Good pass. Good shot. Enum says I'm watching you at work again. You're not the only one. I've seen a lot of you guys in the chat say they're watching me at work. I appreciate you guys showing up even though during work. For some of you guys, maybe during school. Good pass. Good shot. GG. Trevor said, yeah, but chemistry math is way easier than geometry. Yeah. I mean, yeah, basic chemistry is super, super easy. Geometry, it can take you a second to get used to it first. Geometry is pretty chill, though. Shapes and stuff. I haven't taken geometry since, like, 8th grade. Then again, I went to, like, insanely, you know, sweaty schools. People care so much about academics. To be fair, I kind of did, too. Making good grades is important. I've never made a C. Fun fact. JW said Doc's a real grinder. Facts. Triple threat offline today, and then later in the week, triple threat online for sure. I've played so much online, but man, I know some guys who've played even more games than me. I know some guys who've played like 300, 400 games. It's insane, man. Some guys play a lot of games. I've played a little over 100 games of TTO. I've played about, how many games Unlimited? I want to say 40-something, maybe low 50s. I know some guys who've played way more games than that. Good shot. Miami Heat said, Doc the Goat. Eli said, I've never made a B. Trevor said, shapes and stuff. Yeah, I guess linear angles and finding X is in there too. Finding X is more algebra. Solving for a missing variable. That's pretty chill. Joshua Pearson said, Huh, Louis Dampier? He looks really, really good. Especially for a point guard right now. Of course, I remember last year, there was a... Was it a Dark Matter Louis Dampier at the end of the year? Yeah, he wasn't that great, but... This Louis Dampier, compared to all the other point guards in the game right now, is looking pretty good. The only thing he can't do is, like, dunk. He has a 25 driving dunk, but I'm pretty sure he has a 92 ball handle. I'm trying to think of all, all of his other attributes. 92 ball handle. I know he's got like a 93 point shot. I think 90 speed or 92 speed or something like that. He also has like 90 perimeter defense. Badge wise, I don't know how good his defense is looking, but he looks great offensively. Really good offensively. One of the fastest guards in the game. Good drive. Good shot. Braden said he's two feet tall. He's not going to have a dunk. Hey, six feet, two feet. Nah, if he was 5'11", you can call him, um, what's it called? Two feet tall. That's the difference between 5'11 and six feet. Hey, what's up, Hilda? Welcome to the stream. JW said, if I get him, Louis Dampier is going to be my backup guard. Louis Dampier, I'll have to try him out first, but on paper he looks awesome, so he might be, he might be my backup point guard too. Actually, I don't know. Right now, my backup point guard is Kyrie Irving. I like him a lot, but 
I'll have to actually test out Dampier because my backup point guard's Kyrie, my starting point guard's Clyde Frazier, and my third string point guard is... I don't know. It's Bob Cousy right now, but I don't know. I like D. Brown, too. D. Brown is so much more athletic. He has dunks. I don't know, man. I don't know who that third string point guard is going to be for the near future. I guess I'll just keep on playing games with them online, and whoever plays better, I'll use them. Emmett said, yo, Doc, I just finished up school. Now I'm going to grind some triple threat offline. Good luck to you, man. Good luck to you. Get that grind going, man. I hope you actually get Dampier. I never even got Ron Boone, so I'm hoping 2K has some mercy on me today and gives me this new Louis Dampier. Matter said I got Louis. Thank goodness. I played over 300 games and never got Boone. Me too. Me too. I literally just said that. That's crazy timing. JW said Kyrie's my first. He's so good. Yes, he is. Yes, he is. The only thing about Kyrie is that he's a little bit of a defensive liability. Offensively, he's amazing. And defensively, he's not absolutely terrible, but his lateral quickness could be better. Man. Also, in the paint, he can get kind of bullied. Then again, there aren't any super big guards in the game, so... There aren't too many guards out there who would try to bully him, but if you're playing triple threat online, you're gonna run into guys who are using shooting guards, small forwards are the smallest player. It might be tough in triple threat, but in 5v5, you can definitely get by with Kyrie as your starting PG. It's not like he's a complete ass on defense, but I don't know, I prefer Clyde on defense. Dragon Eyes said, thanks for the advice on Kispert. What a legend. Dude, Gold Kispert's just insane. Might be my favorite spot-up shooter in the game. Like, actually. Of course, I have guys who might be better spot-up shooters, who have, you know, really good ratings and really good badges, but Kispert, I don't know. For a gold player, you gotta love that jump shot. It's green pretty much every time. Matter said, just got here too. Hey, welcome to the stream, man. Make sure to drop a like for me if you haven't already. And subscribe, even though I'm pretty sure you already are. Let's see if I can get a three here. Nah, two contested. Okay. JW said, missed out on Kispert. I forgot about him. He's pretty easy to forget about, let's be honest. He's a gold player, and I mean, there's already guys who have pink diamonds, diamonds, amethysts. A lot of guys don't really care about a gold card, but man, he's an insane gold card. If you use him correctly. Bonus time said, how many cards have you collected? No idea. I have no idea. I've been saving up MT. Of course, I, b I could buy, like, jerseys and stuff, and I could buy logos. I already have all the logos, but yeah. I could spend MT on all that stuff, but since I've been trying to save up MT, I've been super stingy, you know, collecting cards. I think I have, like, 600-something. Maybe 500. I don't think I have over 600, but I can check after this game. Good pass. Beautiful. What's up, Valid Key? Welcome to the stream. Trevor said, I don't even know who's in my team. I play Park. I'm glad it's fun this year. I've heard Park's really fun. I know some my team guys who just began streaming Park. If my team gets boring, I might have to move over to Park too for a couple streams. B Jaggy said, What up, Doc? What's good, B Jaggy? Welcome to the stream, my brother. Also, what's up, Patrick? JW said, I would have loved him in my limited lineup. Dude, remember last year in 2K21 where we had to use like all gold teams in limited? If we have the same thing this year, Corey Kispert's going to be the star of that team. 47 points is just insane. Versus anybody. I know the guy I was playing against wasn't that great, but at the end of the day, man, 47 is 47. TC said, why is Dinwiddie so expensive? 
Hmm. I think you need him for an exchange. I think you need him for the James Harden exchange. I could be wrong though. You need him for some exchange. I can't remember whose it is. It's either James Harden or who's the other one? Otis Birdsong, but I'm pretty sure it's James Harden. I didn't do the exchange, so that's why I don't know. Good shot. Matter said Louie. It's honestly Kyrie with way better defense, which is crazy because Louis Dampier is a couple inches shorter. A couple inches shorter, but 92 speed, really good perimeter defense. Not sure if he has clamps, but I know that um, ML Carr has gold clamps. Crazy says, have you ever tried out sniping? Yes. Joshua said, why can't the world be normal? What do you mean? To be fair, the world hasn't been normal in forever. JW said, I've got about 330 cards in my collection. Oh, I was supposed to check my collection. Forgot about that. Completely forgot about that. I'll check it soon though. As soon as I remember to check how many cards I have, I'll check, but it's not that many. It's no more than 600. Valid Key said, yo. Ready said hi to you. Anderson said, best way to beat domination. Um, I think defense is most important in domination. I say it all the time. Defense in those 5v5 game modes is super important. That was a terrible shot. Didn't mean to shoot it. But nah, defense is most important, so... Maybe play a little bit of off-ball, do some defensive settings, and yeah, you'll beat the CPU pretty easily as long as you can lock them up, run the fast break, all those little things. Greek Freak said, Mr. CP of Doc. What's up, Greek Freak? Welcome to the stream, my man. Nightmare said, oh yeah, a stream on my birthday? Happy birthday. How old are you turning? Happy birthday to you, though. Welcome to the stream. Nightmare, Greek Freak, Kyrie 3. We got 91 people in here. You guys say what's up to me if you haven't already. Let me know how you're doing. What you think of this new content today. It's not much, but it's not bad. Hope you guys are enjoying your day so far and the stream so far. Nightmare said I'm 16 now. Nice. So you're legal. Not like that, but yeah. Happy birthday to you, man. 16 is big. 16 is big. Dragonize said, Mitchell Robinson and Ron Harper helped me through domination. And I'm a bad 2K player. I'm telling you, man. Good defensive players will really, really help you. Of course, you also want to run the fast break, drive, kick, run pick and rolls, and get open shots. But yeah, dude, having good defensive players like Ron Harper and Mitchell Robinson really helps. Mitchell Robinson can block shots and get a lot of rebounds for you. He's super athletic, a good driver and roller to the rim. And yeah, Ron Harper, he can slash. He can't shoot super well, but he can dribble. He can defend. He'll do all that stuff very well for you. If you surround him with shooters and run some pick and rolls for Robinson, get some easy pick and roll, alley-oop dunks and stuff like that, you'll be looking great. And of course, time your jump shots. That's pretty important, too. Utku said, hi, CP. What's up, Utku? Welcome to the stream, my man. What's up, Veretta? And what's up, SB Live? SB said, feels like just yesterday. We were celebrating 6,000 subs on this channel. My dude is on fuego. Yes, sir, SB. We're grinding, man. We're grinding. Around this time last year, we had... I want to say 3,500 subs. I think it was Halloween we hit 4,000 subs. I could be wrong about that, but yeah. It was early November, late October, we hit 4,000. And I know by the end of the year we had 6,000, but it really does feel like just at yesterday, SB. Time flies. Welcome to the stream, my brother. We're opening the vault a lot, but no luck just yet. Doc Adams said, 2K is holding me right now. Yeah. Doc Adams is upset, man. He's played through so many boards. He's played for like eight hours now and hasn't seen ML Carr yet. Tough. ML Carr might be the best defensive player in the game. I know I said that earlier, but I really, really want that card. 
Offensively, he might not be anything special, but he's far from a scrub. Utku said, I grinded XP today. Now I'm level 30. Nice. You know, you just reminded me. I'm going to be level 36 soon. That means soon is time for my final ascension board. We already didn't get Ron Boone. I swear. If I don't get Marcus Johnson either, I'm going to be really upset. Well, not really upset. I mean, Marcus Johnson, he wouldn't even make my team. But, like, I still want him. Like, I'm still gonna go for him. Even if Louis Dampier doesn't make my team, I want him. Even if ML Carr doesn't make my lineup, I still want him. Good pass. Good shot. Braden said, who's ML Carr? He played for the Celtics. Some people might call him the greatest cheerleader of all time, but he was also pretty good defensively. He was also great defensively. Oh yeah. Easy money. SP said, must be used to it by now. Facts. If you get hoed by 2k, you can't even... I mean, of course you can be mad about it, but you can't say you didn't see it coming. You can't say you didn't see it coming. Dragon Eye said, did you get Gus Gerard? I got Gus Gerard so easily. So, I'm hoping I get ML Carr just as easily. Because, man, I swear... If it takes me, you know, like, over 10 hours of playing to get ML Carr, I'd be upset. I already didn't get Ron Boone, so 2K has got to cut me some slack. Either they got to give me Louis Dampier easily, or they got to give me ML Carr easily. Because I wanted Ron Boone. I heard that man is awesome. Well, I've played against him, so I know he's pretty good. KC said dog. What's up, KC? Welcome to the stream. Also, what's up, A-Dub? The goat in the building. Good shot. Welcome to the stream, both of you legends. Bonus time said Michael Cooper is one of the best defensive players too. That's facts. I've played against him. Even though he's an amethyst man, he's annoying. Then again, that's how good defensive players are supposed to be. They're supposed to be just annoying. You're supposed to be annoyed by good defensive players. Good pass. Good shot. We get through these games pretty fast, man. I'm not going to lie. A-Dub said, how many games in so far? I haven't really kept count. I want to say like 9 or 10. We're already at 300 wins, so I haven't really done a good job keeping count. But we've opened the vault pretty much every time. The vault opening, that's the first step. But 2K giving me the prize I'm looking for, that's the tougher step, man. That's definitely the tougher step. I didn't get Ron Boone, so... I seriously don't know what, you know, opening the vault and getting a diamond looks like. I know what getting MT looks like. I know what getting tokens looks like. I know what getting, you know, league packs looks like. I don't know what getting a diamond looks like, so... When it happens, I'm just gonna be... Probably in shock. A-Dub said I hate triple threat online. To be honest... Oh, you said offline. Yeah, to be honest, it gets so dry, it gets boring, but I'm planning on playing offline today, then online later in the week. Yeah, offline gets dry, and the CPUs are cracked. Of course, I'm not going to lose any games this stream, but the CPU is not going to go easy. Yeah, offline can get boring. Blaine said, I got Ron now. I'm grinding with you. Hey, good luck to you. Except I didn't get Ron, so... Man, I hope they bring him back later in the season. Even if I don't use him, I, I want to have him. Same thing with all the other diamond rewards. Man, they're playing good defense this game on... What's his name? On Corey Kispert. They're not giving my man any space. Joshua said Kevin Johnson's good. I've heard Kevin Johnson's good. I haven't played against him or used him. A-Dub said, I don't know if I'll ever grind offline for another player after I played like 400 games for Fairy. Dude, I played over 600 games for Fairy. I played like 800 games for Fairy. I thought the Terry Dissinger grind was bad, but Fairy took me 
Man, how many games did Fairy take? Like 800 something? Dissinger took like 315, 320. Honestly, man, even though both of those guys were very good and everybody was grinding for him, it was just, oh dude, he was just invisible. Jeremy said, what up, Doc? What's up, Jeremy? Dallas said, two more Evos until Bobby Boy. Dude, Bob Pettis not bad. Bob Pettis not bad at all. I think you're going to enjoy that card. Also, the Evos are pretty easy for him. The Evos aren't bad at all. A-Dub got Fairy, but didn't get Terry. I got Jerry, too. Oh, Jerry Sloan. He was one of the easier ones to get, I feel like. Jerry Sloan, I feel like I saw him all the time. Terry, Fairy, and Jerry. That does sound like a terrible sitcom, though, man. That sounds awful. Greek Freaks that I need Louis Dampier. I want him. I want him. Like, even if he doesn't make the actual team, he looks great on paper. And looking good on paper is a pretty good reason to go for a card. They're playing good defense on Kispert this game. I gotta green that shot too, though. Dragon Eyes said, when does difficulty go to Superstar and Hall of Fame and Triple Threat offline? I don't think it ever does. I could be wrong, but I think the highest difficulty in Triple Threat offline this year is gonna be All-Star. I mean, even last year, I don't remember the difficulty ever being insanely bad. I think the highest last year was All-Star, so I'm guessing it's going to be the exact same this year. I think the All-Star is going to be the highest it goes. Unless 2K does decide to put it up to Hall of Fame. To be fair, you'll probably have to win a lot of games to get there if they do decide to do that, but I don't know if they will. Triple Threat is supposed to be a chill game mode. You're supposed to just kick back grind out some games, maybe get some challenges done. Triple Threat Offline is supposed to be super chill. So I don't know if they'll do Hall of Fame for that. Good steal. I guess I'll shoot the two. We need two shots to win anyway, so not a bad shot right there. Maybe I can get some XP challenges done while I'm doing this. I haven't really thought about that, but maybe I can. <laughs> Doc Adams says the duck's the easiest to get. Dragon Eye said, not gonna lie, that's good news for me. I mean, yeah, you're not the only one that's good news for, man. A lot of people are struggling against the CPU. A lot of guys are struggling versus the CPUs on All-Star, man. In Domination, dudes are getting destroyed on, like, Rookie and Pro. So, yeah. Hopefully 2K doesn't make the game modes any harder, especially for guys who aren't super experienced playing the game. I have a friend who just started playing 2K. He loaded in Domination, he played on Rookie Difficulty, and he lost by like 25 in his first game because he didn't know what to do. The Rookie CPU was contesting every shot, stealing passes, they were hitting all their open shots. He was just trying to learn how to play the game, but he got destroyed. Because 2K made the CPUs tough this year, man. Of course, we didn't really have a problem with Domination or All-Time Domination, but I know a lot of guys who are. A lot of guys. Oh, yeah. Keep on getting these threes to fall. Last game, this man Kispert was being guarded by Gary Payton, so... Last game was rough. This game should be a lot easier. Even though Havlicek, not a bad defender either. Yeah, we should be fine. Darkest said, man, every offline triple threat game is a sweat for me. By the way, what up? What's up, Darkest? Welcome to the stream. Yeah, you're not the only one, man. I know a lot of guys who are in the exact same boat. But I'll show you a strategy that works. If you have a fast point guard, Call for the screen, go around the screen, draw the help defense, and boom! Every time. Joshua said, I'm not doing the exchange either this year. Yeah, the exchange, it wasn't great last year. There were some good exchanges in like season four, season five, where you get the players from triple threat and then do the exchange, but other than that, nah, the exchange wasn't very good. I'm right with you on that one, Josh. 
Hey, what's up, Jurassic Poo? Welcome to the stream, my man. What's up, Jurassic Poo? What's up, who is Neo? Welcome to the stream, my guys. Brayden said, just picked up Ruby Dario Sarich. I haven't used him, but I've heard he's good. I've heard Ruby Dario Sarich is actually pretty great. For rubies. My favorite rubies are Tim Hardaway Jr. And probably Devontae Graham. Evan Fournier too, but Sarich? He can shoot, he can rebound, he's not terrible on defense. I've heard he's nice. Ujku said Melo's looking so good, man. He has blinders and amazing stats. That's facts. I think Melo's gonna be great. Of course, Melo's my favorite player, so I'm kind of biased, but yeah. I think Carmelo's gonna be awesome. I'm looking forward to getting him. Joshua said domination is easy. If you're used to it, yes, it's easy, but like I said, man, I know some guys who just started playing the game, and they were hoping Domination was going to be a nice, chill, easy introduction to the game, especially on rookie mode, but he was getting killed, so if you know basketball, if you know 2K, you'll be fine. I was fine, you were fine, but I know some guys who were trying to learn how to play the game, but just, oh, they were getting destroyed. Hey, what's up, Fable? Welcome to the stream. Also, what's up, Sharoom Gamer? Shout out to two of my loyal channel members. They got those gold badges by their names. Their names are in green. They got all the emojis. Man, shout out to all my channel members. Welcome to the stream, Fable and Sharoom. Greek Freak said, did you see the MPJ things going on right now? Are you talking about that huge extension he signed? Honestly, I like the move. Denver's not a big market, man. The Nuggets, they aren't necessarily a big, attractive, free agent destination like New York or LA. So, yeah. He's a good young talent. I mean, he averaged nearly 20 points per game this last year, right? So he can score the ball. The dude's like, what, 6'10", 6'11", with scoring ability, handles, good defense. Like, they gotta keep him. They can't let him go. George said, man, you make it look easy. I'm always winning by two. Hey, these games can be tough. I've had my fair share of close games too. I've had my fair share of close games. Not every game is an easy win. I'm right with you on that. There we go. Eugenio said, MPJ just got the bag. Facts. MPJ got paid. He deserves it too. He deserves it. Nate said, just got 2K22. Awesome, man. Awesome. You're going to enjoy it. So far, I think I've enjoyed it. But I don't know. Some things I love, some things I hate. I feel like they've changed the game a lot since it first dropped. On day one, people were so happy, but I'm seeing guys slowly but surely become a little dissatisfied with the game. Danny Ferry said, yo, what's up, Danny Ferry? Welcome to the stream, my man. Greek Freak said the man can hoop nicely next to Jokic. Facts. Yes, he fits in very well next to Jokic. Because he can spot up and hit threes. He can move without the ball, but if you need a bucket at the end of the shot clock, he can make a contested shot. He can step back, create space, and hit contested jumpers. I know he's not, like, amazing at creating space, but he does it pretty well, does it pretty consistently, and even if he doesn't, he'll make those contested jumpers, man. What's up, Anx Aries? Welcome to the stream. Dallas said certain all-time domination games were tough. You just got to focus on defense and you'll be fine. I did have a couple, couple tough games. I can't talk. Yeah, I had a couple tough games too. I had trouble with the Rockets. I got every game done first try, but the Rockets, that one was tough. And I think it was the 2000s All-Stars. That game was way tougher than I expected, but... Yeah, like Dallas said, just focus on defense. Uh, get a lot of stops and in a row. Get stops in a row. Because if you get multiple defensive stops, I think you get like 12 plus 12 MT. If you get steals, you get seven. If you get blocks, you get like seven or eight. And yeah, defense is most important if you're trying to make the MT to, you know, get three stars. Melly Mills said, yo, Doc, what's up, Melly Mills? Welcome to the stream, my man. 
Also, what's up, Royal Ryan? That's a name we haven't seen in a minute. Welcome to the stream, my brother Ryan. How's building that PC coming along? Because we miss your streams. I know it's not just me. Yeah, look at Doc Adams going crazy. We haven't seen Ryan in a minute. Aries says I have 500,000 MT. What do you recommend I do? Do I just hold it? It's 100% your call. 100% your call. If there's a player out there you want to get, go get them. Nobody stopping you. But I don't know. We might get some insane players on Tuesday or Friday. So maybe wait before you spend it. But I got some... Not, not, not some. I got one pretty good player yesterday. I guess you guys will see who it is in my next No Money Spent episode. Just Landon said, Doc, what's up, Landon? Welcome back. Also, what's up, Awesome Shark? Welcome to the stream, both of y'all. A lot of people joining the stream. Melly Mel's, Anks, Ryan, Awesome Shark, Landon. Everybody who's joining, make sure to hit that like button for me if you haven't already. I haven't said that in a long time, but you guys make sure to like the stream for me if you haven't already. And if you're new to the channel, haven't subbed yet, but you like what you see, make sure to subscribe if you haven't already as we continue our triple threat grind. Offline today, online tomorrow, depending on what we get tomorrow outside of PAX. Aries said I had to Kembe, I love him. But I sold him since he was up. I feel that. I feel that. Yeah, Dikembe is nice, but I know there's going to be better stretch bigs. Honestly, I prefer Ibaka's jumper. And Jerry Lucas's. Those two guys are excellent shooters. Oh, man. Late release? I know Trey has a fast jump shot, but man. I thought that was a good release. I was wrong. Ryan said, going well. My friend told me I need 500 to finish it. That's not too bad. That's not bad at all. Take your time. Build that PC. Of course, you want to return to streaming as soon as possible, but... Nah, the game's still going to be wait here waiting for you. The game's going to be waiting for you, and... It is early in the year, so... Yeah, views aren't the best for my team, but... Nah, man. I know you enjoy making content, so... Hope you can get back to streaming ASAP. Dallas said the fact that bronze dudes I've never heard of clamp up diamond players and triple threat offline is absurd. Like I'm trying to get XP and they end up sweating. I'm telling you, man. You'll play versus like six foot one point guards in triple threat offline and you'll be trying to get dunks or something. But they'll jump so high to intercept passes, block your dunks. I'm telling you, man. The bots have like 99 steal tendency, 99 block tendency, it's insane. These bots are pretty good in triple threat offline. These bots are pretty good. Doing challenges has never been harder. But to be fair, we didn't get XP challenges for the first time till last year, so yeah. Good shot. Ares said I got five ball drops and on a run and nine diamond players. And yeah, I have a Baka at the five, Gus at the four. That's pretty good. Yeah, Baka at the five is great. Gus at the four, you could upgrade over him, but I like Gus Gerard a lot too. He's still on my team, but yeah, Ibaka's great. Hey, what's up, Mock Builds? Welcome to the stream, my brother. Doc Adams said 12 boards, no ML car. 12? Like you've gone through 12 individual boards, like 120 games? Or. You've made it through like 12 of the top boards. Either way, that sucks. Like, that's terrible either way. 2K is just screwing you, but yeah, no matter what, that sucks. That is terrible. 2K is hoeing you. I think it's time to take a break. Reset your luck, as some people say. That is terrible. You said 12 top boards. That's still terrible. Like, that is still so bad. If you played through 12 boards, like 120 games or however many, that stinks, but yeah. 12 top boards, definitely not as bad. Still so bad. 2K's gotta, 2K's gotta give you a break. A-E-Z-Ox. 17, thank you for the sub. 
and welcome to Doc Nation. We've been opening the vault like crazy, but 2K has got to give me the player eventually. To be fair though, it's been less than an hour. Welcome to the stream though, Aux, and thank you for the sub. Good shot, Trey. Jeff Gaming said, hi Doc, sorry I'm late. Had to handle some family stuff. Hey, don't apologize for having to be with your family, handle family stuff. I'm just glad you could stop by. Welcome to the stream, my boy Jeff. Ah, oh, bad shot. Aries said, my triple threat online team is Gus, Kyrie, and Glenn. The only issue is Kyrie's defense. I feel you on that. I like Kyrie. He's my backup point guard. He was my starting point guard, but I had to replace him with Walt Fraser. Walt Fraser isn't as good shooting. His jump shot's not as quick, but he is a thousand times better on defense, it feels like. His defense is just crazy. He can shoot the three. He has great handles, great speed. Yeah, if you can get a better defensive PG, you'll be looking good. Good defense. Nice. Dude, Kispert's not missing. This man Kispert's insane. Fable said this week sometime, I'll be able to do my first stream. Dude, send me the link. Send me the link to your channel so I can subscribe to you too. If I'm able to, I'll come through and support, man. I'll come through, show some love. That's so dope you're getting back into streaming. I know you've been waiting on this for a while, so that is awesome. Doc Adams said my logos for 2K aren't working, and 2K support says it's for copyright reasons. They gotta make sure I own it. Are you serious? That is so weird. Really? I mean, I kind of understand, but I don't think that's ever been a problem before. Definitely not for me. That is so strange. Dallas said, has Duncan Robinson ever blocked a shot in his career? He has six in this triple threat game. Are you serious? Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. I'm telling you, man. These CPUs are just... They're different, man. They're different. They're just cracked. Duncan Robinson. Yeah, I don't remember him ever getting a rejection, blocking a shot, but... His CPU and triple threat offline is... Cracked, I guess. Anks Aries says, I have Ron Boone. He might be a better option. I've heard that Ron Boone and Kyrie are pretty similar on defense, but... Ron Boone, of course, has Paul George's base, and he can actually dunk, so, yeah, Kyrie, even though I like him, he's a bit of a defensive liability, and also, he has these really weird layup animations. Some of them are good, some of them are bad, but so many times I'll drive in and Kyrie will just hang in the air doing this weird layup thing, and yeah, it gets blocked. Usually only online, but it happens sometimes offline, too. Great shooter, great ball handler, like great dribble moves, and quick jump shot. He's so fast driving to the rim, but I swear, sometimes he just gets blocked on the silliest looking layups. I like Kyrie, but it's a bit too much sometimes. That's why he's my sixth man now. Ryan said, I know this is old news, but I always wonder what your thoughts were when Kemba joined the Knicks. I was pretty happy about it. I don't know if everybody loves the move like I do, but D-Rose, he plays pretty well as a backup. He can start, but I like Derrick Rose as the sixth man. Kemba's still a really good point guard. Of course, if healthy, he's great. So Kemba's great. Fournier is a great addition. We also re-signed Burks, re-signed Nerlens Noel. So we brought back the guys who played well this past year, and we brought in two guys who can drop 30 on any given night. I mean, Kemba's scored 60 before. Yeah, Kemba's great. Fournier's great. He averaged like 20 points a game with the Magic. First half of last season. Yeah, the Knicks are looking great on offense. They improved. But the Eastern Conference also improved too. The Bulls got better. The Nets got better. So many teams in the East got better. So it's going to be interesting seeing where the Knicks finish. Fable said, can I stream on YouTube? Even though I don't have a thousand subs, you can stream on YouTube with like two subs. You can stream on YouTube with zero subs, I'm pretty sure. 
You can start from the ground up, streaming on YouTube. You have to enable it, but I can't remember how to do that. I did it a long time ago, like two or three years ago. Dallas said Kyrie holds the ball in the air so long. I'm telling you, man, it'll be a wide open layup, but by the time he's actually shooting the layup after doing his, you know, his double clutch or whatever you call it, it's like 93% contested, 100% smothered. Like, if Kyrie just went up and either dunked it or just laid it in normally, it'd be so much easier. So, yeah, Ron Boone finishing? I think I'd take him over Kyrie, in 2K at least. In real life, barely anybody's better at finishing than Kyrie, but yeah, in 2K, 2K22, my team at this stage of the year is different. Oh, no, no, no! Didn't mean to shoot that with Capella. I wasn't even paying attention. I thought that was Corey Kispert. I just shot a game-winning three with Capella. That's crazy. Greek Freak said, so excited for NBA opening night. is going to be a movie. I'm so excited for it. I might be going to the Mavericks Hawks game, but we'll have to see. I'm excited for opening night. Actually, Mavericks Hawks isn't opening night, but it's on Thursday of opening week. Man, those first few games of the season are going to be awesome. I'm looking forward to playing fantasy again. Hey, what's up, Jay Pesos? Welcome to the stream. I'm doing well. Hope everything's good with you too, my man. What's up, Jay? And what's up, Epic? Epic says, can't play my team. It says, my internet can't connect to the server. Try restarting your game or console. It says that sometimes for me too, but usually if I just restart the game or sign in, sign out, something small like that, usually it works. Ryan said, it's good they supplied Randall with more scores. Facts. Yes. That's what he needs. He needs guys around him who can just hit shots. Run, pick, and roll with him. Get him some shots that he doesn't have to create himself. I mean, it's going to be interesting. It's going to be interesting. I think the Knicks got better. Knicks got better. Bulls got better. The Bucks didn't do much, but they'll still be good. The Nets, they didn't do much either, but Paul Millsap's a big move. Patty Mills is a big signing. Yeah. The Nets are going to be fine. The Heat, too. Dude, they're not playing much help defense this game. That was a good shot right there, though. Ryan said, coming up to the yay. Most likely, yes. Not 100% sure, but most likely, yes. I'm looking forward to that game. Luka versus Trey is going to be awesome. Jeff said, imagine if Capella hit that. Nah, that would have been that would have been so tough if he would have made that shot. I didn't even realize it was him. I've been doing the same thing every time. I thought it was Corey Kispert again. Dallas said, who you got tonight? The Cowboys or the Eagles? I got the Cowboys. I think Dak's going to do Dak things. Of course, I like the Eagles. I like Jalen Hurts a lot. But I don't know. I don't think the Eagles are going to win this one. Even though I wouldn't mind it if they did. I like the Eagles better than the Cowboys, but I think Dak's going to do Dak things, and I think the Cowboys are going to improve to 2-1. and one. Ben Park said, any tips for the Warriors Spotlight Sim Challenge? Honestly, that challenge was not as tough as I expected, man. Just play the best defense you can. Focus 100% on defense. Make sure Curry and Clay. You know, don't get open off screens. Make sure you stay with them. Play some off ball if you have to. Whatever you do, don't let Curry and Clay get open for three. And of course, stay with Kevin Durant the best you can. Stay with KD the best you can because he's going to hit some tough mid-range shots. Personally, I won that game by like 40. But I've heard it's been super tough for other people. So focus on defense and on offense. Drive, kick, pick, roll and try to get the best shots you can. Greek Freak said the Bucks actually lost guys. Yeah, PJ Tucker left, and man, somebody else left too. Somebody off their bench, but I can't remember who it was. They still got their same core of guys though. I think it was Thanasis. I think he left the Bucks to play in Greece. I could be wrong. No, I might be thinking about Costas, because he's not in the Lakers anymore, but I'm not sure. 
I know PJ Tucker is on the heat now. And other than that, the Bucks, I'm pretty sure, brought back their core guys. They still have Giannis, Middleton, Holiday, Lopez, Portis. Yeah. Jeremy said, I hope Zeke can finally do something tonight. Yeah, Zeke's got to get more yards, man. He's got to make more plays for the Cowboys. He's still a talented running back, but yeah. They're going to need Zeke if they want to win tonight. Dak's going to do Dak things, but yeah, they need Zeke to go crazy tonight. Gio said, Bryn Forbes, that's right. Yeah, J and Gio, y'all are right. It was Bryn Forbes. He went back to the Spurs. He was big off the bench in, in their playoff run. Of course, he wasn't necessarily their best player off the bench. I think that was Bobby Portis, but man, Forbes is a insanely good three-point shooter. I think they're kind of going to miss him. Kevin said, just hit level 34. Nice. Man, I should be 36 sometime before the end of the week. That means it's time for our final ascension whenever I hit level 36. I swear, we better get Marcus Johnson. I already missed Ron Boone. Good shot. B says, we need fan favorite Diamond Corey Kispert. That'd be awesome. His gold player is freaking amazing. I've been shooting with him and pretty much only him this stream so far. He's just really good. If you didn't get Kispert, I'm sorry. I hope 2K brings him back, but I don't know. If they bring him back, that means they'll probably also bring back that gold Joe Ingles, um, gold Dennis Smith Jr. If they bring Kispert back, they'll probably bring the other guys back too that you can get on weekends. Royal Braden said, no more contracts? I wish. I wish. I mean, here's what I don't like about contracts. If you play a 30-minute game of Unlimited, you use up one contract. But if you also play a 3-minute triple threat game to 21, that uses the same contracts that are used in Unlimited. If there's a way to separate contracts, that'd be great because... I mean, if, if you play five triple threat games in 30 minutes, that's the same time, same amount of time as it takes to play one game of Unlimited, but you use five times as many contracts by doing that, so no more contracts would be cool, but I think 2K likes contracts. I don't think they're going to take them out of the game, so at least give us some alternative contracts that can be used in triple threat, or maybe take contracts out of triple threat. You can play Triple Threat without contracts, but Unlimited, you need contracts. Even that'd be okay. That would be understandable, but yeah. Hawkeye said, I'm back. What's good, Hawkeye? Welcome back. Fable said, do I need a webcam to stream on YouTube? I know plenty of guys who don't use a webcam. Yeah, I know plenty of guys who stream without using face cam. Of course, using face cam, it's, you know, it's preferable. But you can stream without a face cam. You can also stream without a mic, but it's not preferable. Braden said freaking 4K for only five contracts for my team. Yeah, that is so bad, man. That is so bad. If you can not use contracts in Triple Threat Online or Triple Threat Offline, that'd be great. But yeah, contracts, maybe that should be exclusively a unlimited thing. That'd be a good way to fix things up, in my opinion. Hawkeye said, you give your player MT or VC for a certain number of games, so you don't have to buy contracts every game. I mean, not every player, you know, runs out of contracts at the same time, though, so it pretty much is every game. Are you trying to justify contracts? Nobody likes contracts. Braden said, I saw the new Dark Matter gem. What do you think of it? If you guys have seen the new Dark Matter gem, what do you think of it? I don't think it's terrible, but you know what I do think is terrible? The new Galaxy Opal gem. I think Galaxy Opal rewards are going to look cool, but yeah, Galaxy Opal players with that circular gem thing in the top left corner, it could look better. I wouldn't say it's absolutely terrible, but I don't like it. Personally, not a big fan. Hey, what's up, Sage? Savvy. 
Welcome to the stream, my brother. We have over 100 people in here. I haven't said this in a while, but you guys make sure to drop a like on the stream for me. A thumbs up if you haven't already. We're grinding for Louis Dampier. Can we get him today? Jeff said it's mid. Yeah, not a fan of it. Not a fan of that new Galaxy Opal gem. Dark Matter looks better, though. SB said, since your players actually get hurt, contracts are the most annoying thing in the game. Facts. Contracts are super annoying. Injuries might be a bit more annoying, but yeah, contracts, injuries, they're both up there. They're super annoying. I'm right with you on that, SB. Sharum said, can Dan Pierce shoot? He has a 92 three-point shot. I'd say that's pretty good. I mean, you can green with guys who have like a 73-point shot. So yeah, I think a 90 is pretty good. Hey, what's up, Noah? Welcome to the stream. What's up, Desiree? What's up, Dark Nico? Nico said, I was just the 100th like. Nice, man. Nice. Hey, thank you guys for 100 likes on the stream. It's barely been over one hour, but we just hit 100 likes. That is a huge dub, so... Welcome to the stream, everybody. Thank you all for liking the stream, if you already have. Up next, let's go for 200. Hey, what's up, Just Austin? The weird one said, I pulled D-Wade's signature, event card in PlayStation. Nice. Crazy said I was the 100 first like. Eh. That's pretty cool, but 100, that's the one. 100th like, that's big time right there. 101's still pretty good, though. Can't complain about that. Wow, he actually made that. Sage Savvy says, I hope you get the logo this year. You deserve it. We got a lot of work to do, but let's keep on grinding. Maybe I will get the logo this year. I appreciate you, man. It's going to take a lot of grinding, a lot of hard work, but I feel like we have the drive to pull it off. What's up, A. Owens? Hawkeye said, hey, Austin, you're actually cool now, not going to lie. Austin's always been cool. Some people just had some weird vendetta against Austin. People chose not to like Austin, but that's my guy right there. I've always supported Austin. I don't see why people just had so much hatred for him. That's my guy right there. HB said, good day. What's up, HB? Good day to you too. Amanda said, do you remember me? I was in the domination stream. That was a while ago, but welcome back. I said in the discord he's a b-word sometime a lot of you guys are b-words in the discord whenever I come to check there's always something going on somebody's cussing at somebody but I know, I know at the end of the day it's all jokes McCulloch said what's up doc what's good McCulloch welcome to the stream good shot Corey said, do you think getting a 9.5 graded Marvin Bagley for 2,950 is a snipe? I sold him back for 4,000 after I did the XP. Is that really a snipe? I feel like it kind of is. 9.5 is good, not great, but if you were able to sell him back for 4,000, that is pretty good. Good pass. GG. Crazy said, did you buy cross-gen? Yes, I did. Sharoom said, Austin has always been a legend? I think I'm right with you on that one, man. He's always been a legend. Sometimes for the wrong reasons, but we like Austin around here. I know Dom's not a big fan of him, but I don't know. Hey, Owen said, LaFood is still the best clan ever. There aren't many people in the La clan anymore. Other than LaFood. I don't even know if he's in here right now. And that's not even his name right now. I'm pretty sure his name is I Like Food Again. Mmm, this is a pretty good team. Defensively. 
Nah, we should be fine. Wings of Wong says, has the vault been opening more? Honestly, it's been opening a lot. The vault's been opening a lot this stream. We just haven't gotten anything good. Well, we've gotten some decent stuff, but we don't really care about, you know, packs. We don't really care about, you know, tokens. They're good, but we want that diamond. We want that diamond damp here. The vault's been opening a lot, but we just haven't gotten anything great yet. I mean, the vault. V-O-L-T has been opening a lot, but we haven't gotten anything great yet. Javen said, yo, Doc, what's up, Javen? Welcome to the stream, my man. Javen says, I can be here a lot. I got sent home. I have to quarantine because I got COVID. Oh, that is tough, man. You gave me the good news. Then you gave me the bad news, man. That's tough. I'm glad you can be here more, but I'm sorry you have the virus. I hope you have a speedy recovery. I hope you can get back out there and play your games ASAP, man. That is tough. Welcome to the stream, but that is super tough, so I wish you a speedy recovery. Mirza said, what's up, Doc? What's up, Mirza? How's it going? Pretty good. Hope you've been doing well, too, Mirza. Greek Freak said, what do you think of the lucky number seven badge? What does that badge do? I see it come up all the time, but what does lucky number seven actually do? I should know, but I don't. I know what most of the badges do, but... Lucky number seven, what does that do? I see it all the time, I just don't know what it actually does. Oh dude, I threw it off Jarrett Allen's head. Oh, that is so trash, what am I doing? The Trey Pound said, what's good doc, what's up Trey Pound? Welcome to the stream my man. There's a good pass, not off Jarrett Allen's head. Dallas said, I was exposed, so work is making me get tested. Test tomorrow, two days till results. I'll enjoy the mini vacation. Hey, I bet you will, man. You can't complain about a mini vacation. Hey, also, you can't complain about a new sub. Shout out to Itor Bernie. Thank you for the sub, and welcome to Doc Nation. Good shot. What's up, Itor? What's up? I am Mont. Welcome to the stream. Mirza said lucky number seven is the opposite of clutch shooter. Wait, wait, what does that mean then? Greek Freak said it gives you a boost to your shots within the first seven seconds. Oh, dude. So instead of boosting your shots at the end of the clock, it boosts your shots in the first seven seconds of the clock. So this should go in. Yeah. Let's see if it actually activated because that was a fast shot. Let's look at the top right corner. Dimer, of course. Um, nothing else. I know what y'all mean, though. So, first seven seconds of the shot clock. Okay, let's see if it activates right here. Let's see. Okay, we didn't even get to see. That was such a fast shot, but... We didn't get to see it. Either way, I get the picture now. I know what y'all mean. Hey, what's up, Mark Quinn? Welcome to the stream. Ayamont says, I got COVID, trying to go to my grandma's house, grandma's funeral. I've had it for eight days now. That is tough. That is tough, man. RIP to your grandma. Also, I hope you recover ASAP. Greek Freak said he might not have it. That's true. That's true. He might not have it. Let's see. Let's take a look at Corey Kispert's badges real quick. Catch and shoot, set shooter. Yeah, no lucky number seven. No lucky number seven. Maybe Trey Young has it, but I'm not shooting with him anyway. Big Hex said lucky number seven is incredible during fast breaks. I bet. I bet. I mean, you don't even have the green the shot. It gives you a boost as long as you shoot it fast. That's an awesome badge to have. If you have clutch shooter and lucky number seven, that's pretty good for you. I'm not going to lie. Maybe Trey Young has it, but I'm not sure. Doesn't really matter if he does, though. Sharoom said Austin's a legend in the chat, and he always will be. I agree. Shout out to you supporting Austin, man. Shout out to you showing Austin some love. 
People love to hate, but Austin's a legend. Jamari said, finished up my work. That's a dub, Jamari. Welcome back. Austin said, sadly, I got to head out, but I hope you guys enjoy the stream and have a good day. You too, Austin. Take it easy, man. Thank you for dropping by as usual. My boy Austin always shows up, always drops into the chat. Hip Hop says, hope you're all good. I am. Hope you're all good too, Hip Hop. I am Mont said, I'm feeling better, but I still tested positive, so still got to be safe around my family. Yeah, I hear you, man. I hear you. I'm glad you feel fine. Brandon said, yo, Doc, I'm a little late. My bad. You're not too late, man. It hasn't even been 90 minutes yet, so you showed up at a pretty good time. I also haven't gotten the vault player yet, so yeah, we're still grinding, still going. You are not too late. Welcome to the stream, Brandon. Hey, we got 109 people in the stream, man. We got over 100 people in here chilling. I hope you guys are enjoying the stream so far. Hope y'all are enjoying the grind. If you're just getting here, talk to me. Make sure to drop a like for me if you haven't already, as we keep on grinding for damn peer. Hip Hop said, glad to hear it. I'm all good, thanks bro. Hey, no problem. Glad you're doing well. Speaking of doing well, Corey Kispert has been doing real well this stream. This man just can't miss. Landon said, so close to 22,000. Hey, we are getting pretty close to 22,000. I think we can definitely get there before October. Definitely, so you guys make sure to subscribe if you haven't already. Especially if you like what you see. Subscribe, enjoy the content, as we continue our push to 22,000. 21.9 is pretty good, but 22, it looks better, sounds better, easier to say. Y'all know the vibes, man. Hey, what's up, Ben? Welcome to the stream. Hawkeye said I like waffles, me too. I am Mont said 2K and Madden have been keeping me from going crazy in this house. I'm gonna try and get the vault player. Dude, Louis Dampier looks really good. He looks great, so that's why we're going for him. And ML Carr in Triple Threat Online also looks great. I'm gonna have the sweat going for him though, so we'll save the sweating for another day. Landon said like the stream and sub, yes sir. Y'all heard the man. Like the stream, subscribe as we continue our grind. Good shot. Brandon said there's a new vault player. I didn't even get Ron Boone. Neither did I. Neither did I, man. I've brought this up so many times. 2K better give me this new player because I didn't get Ron Boone. I didn't get Ron Boone. I haven't gotten Marcus Johnson yet. My luck opening the vault just hasn't been good in 2K22 so far. Like, I've played well in Triple Threat Online, Offline, Limited, Unlimited, Draft. I've played well, but my luck just hasn't been there. Well, we have gotten Glenn Robinson. We got Gus Gerard. I mean, we pulled three D-Wades on my other account on Friday. My luck has been there, but like, not in the places where I want it to be, necessarily. So, hopefully 2K can make up for it today. Hip Hop said, I got Rudy's signature out the vault. 500 MT? Is Gobert's signature really that cheap? I'm not surprised, but yeah. I think I got it too, so... Yeah, probably not even going to sell it on the auction. Hawkeye said, time to kill people on COD. Nice. Yeah, killing? We're not doing that. We're just chilling, trying to open this vault, man. No need for violence in this stream. Good pass. Good shot. Hip Hop said, must have a fair few hours in your streams by now. Yeah, you're in here all the time. Shout out to everybody who's in here all the time. I can name a few names. Hawkeye, Landon, Dom. I wouldn't say he's in here all the time, but he's in here whenever he can be. And the man is, what, number two an hour still? So... I gotta give Dom credit. 
Emmett said, yo, what's up, Emmett? What's up, Connor? And what's up, Fable? Welcome back. Good shot. Brandon says, I hope you get it this time. I hope so, too. I hope so, too. I didn't get Ron Boone, so... The least I can ask for is... 2K giving me the new player. Louis Dampier. He might actually make my team. Good shot. Hey, what is up, Shrek? Welcome to the stream. Ben said, Corey Kispert's OP. Dude, I'm telling you. I'm telling you. If you guys didn't see my new video... You missed out on a epic performance from Corey Kispert. The man dropped 47 in four minute quarters. It was insane. The man went like 12 for 13 from three. It was, it was truly something special. Something to behold. Greek Freak said, what's up doc? What's good Greek Freak? Nate says, I'm, I'm grinding triple threat while watching you. That makes two of us grinding this triple threat. One token though? Like, come on, man. We're winning all these games just for one token. 2K can definitely give me something better than that. Landon said, 51 hours, baby. You've been grinding. Oh my gosh. I'm sorry, but Spud Webb just dunked on me. You've been grinding though, Landon. Brandon said, did you get your third limited ring? Yeah, I did that on Friday. I streamed it on Friday. You guys were there. Well, some of you guys were there. I don't know if all you guys were there, but I know a bunch of you guys were. It was a pretty epic game. Hawkeye said the first stream I was in, you were grinding for Kawhi? I wonder, was I going for Kawhi on my account or Doc Adams' account? Because... I never got Kawhi on my account because I got banned for promoting an MT selling website. So I had to get Kawhi for Doc Adams on his account. Shout out to Doc Adams, man. Letting me grind for content on his account when I got banned last year. Good times. Well, not getting banned, but, you know, streaming. Good times. Good pass, good shot. Dynamite said, yo, just got out of practice. Hey, what's good, man? Welcome to the stream, Dynamite. Hope you had a good practice. It's good to have you back in the stream. Also, what's up, Ernest? Greek Freak said, don't do that again. Oh, I definitely won't. I got banned for like a month. 2K did me dirty. They banned everybody for like two weeks. Codeine got banned for two weeks. Who else got banned? Oh, Dre got banned for two weeks. I mean, a lot of people got banned in 2K21 for promoting MT selling, but man, they gave me a long ban. I don't know why. 2K did me dirty. Crazy said, how do I see my hours? You can't see individual hours, but you can see the top 10 and top 20 hours. Eventually, I'll set it up so you can see your own hours though, individually. David said, yo, how long is the stream going to be? No idea, man. I kind of want to stream until I get the player, but if I don't get the player, it'll probably be, let's say, four hours. Maybe five. Depending on how I'm feeling. We'll see. Spazix said, yo, CP the doc. I won't chat too much. I usually lurk. Just wanted to let you know I love your streams. Hey, thank you. Thank you for coming out of lurking just to say that. Hey man, no matter how much you talk in the chat, whether you talk all the time or, you know, you lurk, as long as you're in here, that's all that matters. Spazix, just remember, there are two rules to lurking. If you like the stream and subscribe, you're allowed to lurk, so, hey, make sure you do that stuff before you hang back. For real though, I appreciate the love. Hey, what's up, Michael Sherman? He said, how are you, bro? I'm doing great, Michael. Hope it's been a good day for you too, my man. And there's my boy Dan Whiteman, always dropping dubs in the chat. Yeah, speaking of lurking, Dan really is the king of lurking, man. Some guys say, dude, I'm the best lurker. But Dan is really the best lurker because he never brings attention to it. He's always chilling and he's always in here. Whenever I bring up lurking, he'll say what's up. 
he'll drop a single W in the chat. He'll donate every now and then, but yeah, he is always just chilling, always vibing. Hawkeye said, just Landon, touch some grass. Hey man, you gotta give Landon credit. He has like a 30 hour lead in the top 10, top 20 hours. He is by far leading this channel in hours. I'm pretty sure Legend is still number one in points, but yeah, Landon, he's not blowing that lead in hours. Spazic says, I always like the stream and I'm subscribed. If you want me to, I'll start being active in the chat. That's 100% your call. 100% your decision. I mean, talking in the chat is not really a requirement, but yeah, you guys just make sure you're chilling, enjoying the stream. You don't have to talk unless you want to, man. If you enjoy just lurking, vibing, playing the game while watching and listening, that's 100% okay with me. 100% okay with me. Big said 275 wins, finally got Ron. Dude, I played over 300 games and didn't get Ron. You're lucky. Oh, dude, Blaze NBA 2K's in the building. That is so dope. Blaze said, been here for a good minute. Gotta go, have a great stream. All love, dude. I'm subscribed to Blaze. That is so dope. That is so dope. We've got an energetic in here before, of course. Aiden Ross was here last week, dude. Blaze in the building. Man, take it easy. Thank you for dropping by. You should have let us know you were in here. Then again, the chat probably would have gone crazy. Dude, that's so dope. Blaze in the building. Over 100k subs. Proud to say I'm one of them. I don't know if you're still in here, but I do love your content and I appreciate you. Blaze is a grinder. That man's a big grinder. I'm pretty sure he has 500 wins in Triple Threat Online. I'm pretty sure he was also the first to get all the... All five Pink Diamond players. He's a big time grinder. Big time. Connor says, can you give me good luck for Louie? Yes. Well, I need good luck too. I didn't even get Ron Boone. I didn't even get Ron Boone, so... I don't know if I even have luck to give you. Emmett said, what's the best price to sell Signature Cat? I don't know how much he's going for. I want to say like 28k. I'm seriously not sure. I checked the other day, but I forgot just as fast as I looked. Hawkeye said 500 wins. He and Landon got to touch some green stuff. Hey man, I look up to that type of grinding. That is insane. He's like 530. Eli said, I can't play Domination. I keep on getting error codes. 2K still hasn't fixed that, and I have no idea why. Crazy GC said, what's the top channel points reward? Channel points? I don't know, but I'm definitely going to start doing rewards for hours. I'll probably give Landon some VC. Blaze said, first to have all five Pink Diamond token cards and all token cards. I knew it. I was trying to go for the first 1,000 Triple Threat Online wins, but somebody has a 200 win lead on me. I'm currently 670 and 63. And most of those losses are, what's it called? I saw this on Twitter. I saw this on Twitter. Most of those losses were just error codes and crap like that. Man, no, for real. It's so dope you came through. Take it easy. Have a good rest of your day. And thank you again. That is... Super dope that you're in here. When you get someone in your stream that you actually watch and are a pretty big fan of, that's a pretty great thing. Take it easy, Blaze. Hey, what's up, Dr. Toothbrush? Welcome to the stream. Alright, we gotta get some more open shots than that. We can definitely do better than that. Darkest says, that was a pretty fast vault update, or is it every two weeks? They usually do it about halfway through the season, a little before halfway through the season. So, yeah, it's been two weeks with Ron Boone. Then I think we're going to have like two weeks with Louis Dampier. And then for the last week or two of the season, we're going to have Louis Dampier and Ron Boone. So, 
We haven't necessarily missed Ron Boone, but he's not going to be here again until the end of the season. And yeah, at the end of the season, they'll probably have both Ron Boone and Dampier in the vault. Creationist said, CP and Blaze collab? I don't have 2K22 on PlayStation, but you never know. But no, that's so dope he was in here. And of course, I'm a fan of his channel too, so that's just pretty great stuff. Welcome to the stream though, Creationist. Also, what's up, Logan? If anybody joined and I didn't read your name, I'm very sorry about that. But welcome to the stream, everybody who's joining. Emmett said, what's the best price to sell Signature Cat? I think I responded. I don't know the best price. I forgot it. I want to say he's going for like a little less than 30k. I'm not sure though. I might be thinking about Blake Griffin, but I can't remember his price. So don't take my word for it. Good pass. Good shot. Michael said, just got off work. Thanks for helping me get through. No problem, man. No problem. I'm glad I can help. Very glad I can help and be there for you. Spazic says, how do you get points and how do you spend them? There's a lot of ways to get points, man. Um, subscribe to the channel and I think you get like 15, 20 points. If you donate, you get 50 points for every $1, but the easiest ways to get points are by playing little mini games in the chat. There's one called Heist. There's another one called Gamble. You can also duel people for points, and you can also just, you know, talk in the chat. You get five points every five minutes if you talk in the chat. If you don't talk in the chat, you get three points every five minutes. So there's a lot of ways to get points. But points, they are kind of pay to win because my boy Legend is number one in points. All because he's donated like $800, so... Yeah, Legend is literally, like, by far number one in points, so they're kind of pay to win, but you can also get them by just watching the channel. Codeine says, I have arrived. Yes, sir, Codeine. Welcome to the stream. And yes, you missed Blaze being here. Blaze is a goat. He's the ultimate grinder. Welcome to the stream, Cody. Welcome to the stream, Cry Spooky. We got 115 people in here. You guys make sure to drop a like on the stream for me if you haven't already, if you're just joining. I know we hit 100 likes earlier, but I'm not sure how many we have right now. Our goal by the end of the stream is going to be 200. Spazic said, do you spend points or do you just save them up? Well, there are some ways to spend points. If you look in the chat, you can redeem GIFs that show up on the screen, but I'm going to add some other things in the future. That you can spend points on. For example, some of you guys might know No Limit Zo. You can spend points in his chat and he'll rate your team if you do that. Like he'll pull up your team and rate it on the spot if you spend points. He also has GIFs. I know some guys who, you know, have rewards for spending points. You can redeem GIFs that show up on the screen, that play during the stream, and yeah, that's one cool thing. I'm gonna add a lot more. Since you guys haven't brought up that stuff in a while, I gotta add some new rewards. GIFs are cool, but I can definitely give y'all some cooler stuff. I've had a lot of ideas in the past, but nobody's brought it up, so I just haven't really thought about it. Hey, what's up, Shawnee? Welcome to the stream. Mig said, hey, Doc, next time you get the vault, can you stop for three seconds? So I can see the new rewards. Yes. Well, there's only one new reward, Mix. The only new reward is Louis Dampier. And you can find him on the 2KDB. See what he looks like. He's the only new reward in offline. In online, there is ML Carr. I wouldn't call him a Celtic legend, but he is very good. He's a very good Celtics player in 2K. Good shot. But yeah, welcome to the stream, Shawnee. Somebody else joined. I think I might have missed their message. I'm trying to read everything, but the chat's been flying this stream, man. Mig said, oh man, I just got Ron last night. Dude, you're so lucky for that. 
You were so lucky for that. I never got Ron Boone. They'll bring him back eventually, but yeah. Good shot. Oh my gosh, and one. Four point play. Corey Kispert. That's beautiful. Spazic says, cool. I got a shower, but I'm going to hop on right after. Have a good stream. Appreciate you, Spazix. Thank you, and I'll see you again soon. Dallas said, Matt Bonner just shot two for 33. His shot is so slow, it's impossible to get him open. Dallas, I was actually able to evolve Matt Bonner pretty easily. I'll show you how. I'll show you how. I think I played... I can't remember what game it was, but I literally just called for screens for him off the ball. And I was able to get him open with off-ball screens. It's kind of hard to explain, but I'll do it right here. So, Corey Kispert, receive screen, and yeah. He'll just run around the screen like that and get the open three. That was not open, but if you get a better player with like brick wall to set screens, you'll be able to get open threes for Matt Bonner. That's what I did. And I was able to evolve him like super fast just by doing that. Of course, it didn't work right there when I was trying to demonstrate, but that's how I got it done. Hey, what's up, Minto? Minto said, what's good? I just tuned in about 30 minutes ago, and I'm loving the stream. Hey, I appreciate you, man. Glad you're enjoying the stream so far. Make sure to subscribe if you're enjoying it, though. I'm trying to grow this channel every day. I'm trying to see if we can get 22k by October. I think we can. Noah said, hey, Doc, sorry. I haven't been chatting. I've been doing homework. Homework's more important, man. I know you might like the streams a bit better, but yeah. Get your homework done. I appreciate you dropping by. Dallas said, thank you. Tried it once in green. Yeah, man, if, you, if there's actually a good player that you can get, like, open off screens, or, I mean, a good player who can set screens, you'll get an open shot every time. The way I did Matt Bonner's threes, I think I played a game of Dirk's Spotlight Challenges. I think it was game number eight, and I literally just called for a, for a receive screen every single time. I'll try it again right here, because it's pretty good. It's pretty effective. It didn't work last time, but you can get open every single time just by calling that play, and there we go. Open shot off the screen. If a really good player sets the screen, if they have like at least silver brick wall, I'd say, you know what I mean? Pretty good strength. Then they should get the other team's players stuck on the screen and yeah, you should be good. Of course, I could call that every single time, but doing this is a little bit faster. Wow. And one. Low key, I shouldn't have shot that, but eh, pretty good shot. I can't complain. Mento said, already done it. Hey, you're a real one for that. You're a real one for that. You guys be like Mento, man. Subscribe if you haven't already. Good shot, Kispert. Hey, what's up, Dre? Welcome to the stream. Emmett said, is Emerald John Morant really good? Yes, he actually is. For an Emerald player, he's very good. He can dunk. His jump shot's actually not bad. In his duo with Brian Reeves, he's really good, so if you get Emerald John Morant and Sapphire Brian Reeves, that's a really, really good duo. Oh, dude, good defense. The CPU wasn't having it right there. The CPU knew what I was up to right there. Darkest said, do the shoes you put on players show up in the game? I have a few players with diamond shoes and they don't show up. Usually they do. Usually they do. Yeah, if you put a shoe on your player, you should be able to see it in the actual game. I don't know why you can't. Ben said, I subscribed last year. You're a real one for that, Ben. Quite possibly an OG for that. Bad shot. Mig said John Morant always clamps me up in offline. He's a good defender too. He can defend. His jumper is pretty easy to time. And of course, super athletic. But it's John Morant. That's pretty obvious. 
How was that late? I shot that so fast. Troyaholic said, Doc, hey. What's up, Troyaholic? Welcome to the stream, my brother. The creationist said, I maxed out my My Career player, so now I'm back on my team. Yes, sir. Back on the My Team grind. I've loved it so far. I gotta play more My Career. Cash said, is Louis Dampier the vault reward? Yes. So Louis Dampier is the new vault reward, and there's also a new triple threat online player named ML Carr, who might be the best defender in the game. Patrick said it only shows up online. Seriously? I didn't realize that. To be fair, not many of my players actually have shoes right now. Noah said I'll chat once every few minutes so I can earn points while doing homework. Great stream, by the way. Thank you, Noah. You're a real one, man. Hey, what's up, Mini2Hype? Welcome to the stream. That's a name I haven't seen in a long time. Is he good? The exchange one from last year wasn't great. I've heard the new Louis Dampier is great. Of course, I haven't used him much, but this Louis Dampier is different than the one last year. Remember, in NBA 2K21, at the end of the year, if you didn't use like a tall lineup, if you didn't use a 6'10", 6'11 point guard, you weren't going to be very good. That's how it was last year. If you used like short guards and triple threat online, you'd get killed. Unless you were me in that video I made at the end of the year. But yeah, um, he's pretty good. He has really good speed. He's one of the fastest PGs in the game. He has a 93 point shot, 92 speed, 90 perimeter defense, really good badges. I mean, he's actually really good. One of the top, I'd say, 5 or 10 point guards in the game right now. I know it sounds crazy, but Louis Dampier is actually good. It sounds insane, but yeah. He looks great on paper. And I've heard he's actually great, you know, in the actual game too, which is crazy. Carter says, make sure you drink some water. You know, I don't think I've drank much water this stream, so thank you for reminding me. I'll make sure to drink some soon, maybe after this game. Good pass. Eh, not a great shot. I could have timed that better. Two Hype said, should I get NBA 2K22? I can't play much because I have football. I've enjoyed NBA 2K22 so far. I mean, I don't know. I've heard a lot of different opinions on 2K22, but most people I know love it. Park players love it. My team content creators are kind of 50-50 on it right now, but I'm personally enjoying it. I think it's definitely an upgrade over 2K21. I'm liking it a lot better than 21 so far. Ben says, you're the only person I know who doesn't while streaming 2K. Who doesn't what while streaming 2K? You might have forgotten a word right there. Mig says, I'm one of the few who loved his exchange card last year. Yeah, man. I don't know many guys who actually got exchange Louis Dampier. And he wasn't very good at the end of the year because, like I said, everybody was using tall point guards. Everybody was using, you know, teams of James Wiseman, Taco, and let's say Kevin Durant in Triple Threat Online. So he wasn't very good in Triple Threat Online because he was a walking mismatch. You can score on him every single time. And even with bigger players, taller players, you can run right past him. He was a liability in Triple Threat Online, Unlimited. He couldn't score over taller players, but I'm telling you, man, this new damn peer... Looks like he'll be a beast, at least for now. He's not super tall, but you don't have to need, you don't have to have a super tall point guard to get buckets. You can score on guys by running past them. You can use mismatch expert to, you know, make buckets over taller defenders. And yeah, Dampier is looking like he's going to be a beast. Dre said, is Ja going to make it to the NBA Finals before Luka? I don't think so, man. I don't think so. Yes! 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 Dude, that's what I'm talking about. In less than two hours as well? That's a dub. I didn't expect that. I didn't see that one coming, man. I need some dubs in the chat right now. Yes! 
I didn't get Ron Boone, but I guess we got Dampier. I guess that means we can test him out. Maybe play some games online with him. Yeah, there we go. Airball 2K, Jericho, Eugenio, Hawkeye, King Ken. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about right there, man. And there's the Zion yelling. Zion's getting hype in that GIF. Let's go ahead and open up this pack, man. Let's go ahead and get this pack up. Just Landon said what happened. Oh, come on, Landon. Don't tell me you missed this. Don't tell me you missed this. Goal of the stream. Complete. Let's go, baby. Louis Dampier's in the house. Man, I love seeing the chat get hyped like this. Of course, Louis Dampier's only six feet tall, but I've heard the man's a beast. I've heard the man's an absolute beast. Let's go ahead and check out his stats, attributes, and see what he's looking like. I'm not going to show you guys my new lineup yet because, you know, spoilers for the next No Mind Spent episode, but... Let's take a quick look at Triple Threat Rewards. Louis Dampier. Only 6 feet tall, but let's go over all the attributes. 92 layup, 90 mid-range, and 93. He can't dunk, which I know kind of sucks, but... 90 ball handle, pass IQ is great. 89 perimeter defense, 92 speed, 92 acceleration, great stamina. Mismatch expert, Hall of Fame, of course. Floor general is pretty good. Gold catch and shoot, acrobat, ankle breaker. Yeah, Dampier's looking pretty good. Gold blinders, gold pick dodger. He's got pretty good defensive badges. Gold quick first step too. Unpluckable. Does he have clamps? I don't know if he has clamps, but... Let's go back up and talk about some of these badges, man. Silver stop and go, silver handles for days, downhill, limitless spot up. He's actually a pretty good card, so... Let's go and play a game online with him. The stream hasn't even been two hours long yet, so... Let's play a game online. Let's have some fun. Let's get Louis Dampier in there. And let's surround him with some good players. Glenn Robinson and... Uh, Serge Ibaka. Why not? Let's play a game with him online. And I guess we'll end the stream afterwards. Man. We did it. We got Louis Dampier in less than two hours. Hey, what's up, Kyrie? Three! Welcome to the stream. Alright, let's do this. Louis Dampier. Let's go ahead and throw it ahead. Let's get an easy layup. Off rip. This man's got Cade Cunningham. And he's also got Carl Towns. He's got a nice little squad. He's got a nice little squad. Louis Dampier might be a little bit of a mismatch because he's six feet, but I think he's pretty good defensively. I mean, look at him. Look at him. Ah, that wasn't very good. Dr. Toothbrush said grind triple threat online now. Eh, I don't know. I might end the stream after this because I do have some work I got to get done. I don't know. Ah, bad shot. Bad shot. Quick release, but not a good shot. I think that's base 98. I think that's base 98. That was a bad shot, though. Ryan said, gotta go to a dorm meeting. Glad I could witness greatness, A. Hey, shout out to you, Ryan. Thank you for coming through. I'll see you later. I'll talk to you later, man. What a terrible animation. Nah, shout out to Ryan for coming through. I'm glad you could witness us succeeding. Now let's play some defense. Great contest by Dampier. Let's make sure we win this thing. Dampier's wide open. Dampier late. Are you serious? Dude, his release is fast. That was so fast. I got a light on that. Mank said Louie has Tony Parker's release. I didn't realize that. The first shot I took looked like base 98. It looked kind of like it, but I appreciate you clarifying that. Now let's keep on scoring, man. We've played good defense, but we got to get some buckitos, man. We gotta get some buckets. Let's see if I can get a bucket right here with Glenn. Cade Cunningham, he's not guarding that. Oh wow, I guess he is. Cade Cunningham is locking up Glenn Robinson? That's crazy. Michael said, Dub, we behind you. Yes, sir. I need y'all to get hyped this game, man. Louis Dampier's debut. 
I'm over 2 with him, but I'm trying to figure out his jump shot. I'm trying to figure it out, because my first shot was a little bit early, but it was contested. Second shot was late, because I didn't realize it was so fast. Good defense by Dampier. Let's give Dampier the ball. I could score with Glenn Robinson every time, but let's get some bucks with Dampier. Oh, I made him fall, but I kept on dribbling into him. Great move, but I should have shot that earlier. Good shot, Surge. Michael said, let's see what he can do. He can handle the ball. He can handle the ball. I just got to figure out his jump shot. Good defense. Oh, dude, how'd Cat get so open? It's no big deal. All right, Dampier. Two assists. Super shifty, quick off the dribble. Nice blow by. Draw the help defense. Knock down the shot. Good releases, but we got to green that. Let's play some better defense. Ah. He got in a good position right there. That was a dumb double team. Three assists for Louie, but no buckets yet. Good pass. Good shot. Dude, can I green a shot? Noah said congrats. Do you think I can get him? I think you can. It didn't take any very long. I thought it would take a lot longer than just an hour 50 to get Dampier. He's played pretty well in this game. Even though I haven't scored with him, he's super quick. He's fast. He's drawing help defense, and that should have been an assist, but bad luck. Bad luck. It's no big deal, though. I like the way we're defending. Okay. I thought he was going to shoot that. I guess not. Good defense. Yeah, we're right there. Fair enough. Let's keep on rolling. Let's keep on running that pick and roll, man. We're getting some good open looks. We got a mismatch right here. Let's see if I can cross him up. Oh my gosh. Oh my goodness. Now he's open for three. I guess I'll take the two instead. Dude, I wanted to drive in and dunk with him. My first instinct was to drive in and dunk, but I forgot he's like six feet tall. And that's a 25 dunk. That was my first instinct. Beautiful play though. But yeah, I almost drove in and tried to dunk with him. That wouldn't have been a good idea. I completely forgot he's six feet tall with a 25 dunk. Mig said before you end the stream, can you show upgradable badges? Yes. Yes. Just remind me and I got you. I didn't mean to shoot that garbage, man. That was supposed to be a little mid-range jump shot, but it's no big deal. Good defense. Yeah, we're right there. He's going to score right here probably, unless I foul, but we're right there. Landon said my stream was delayed. That's why I was so weirded out about people spamming. Yeah, guys were spamming dubs about me getting damn peer. Nice steal. Nice steal. I'm getting a shot early. I'm getting a little late sometimes. His shot is super quick, but not a bad little debut for Dampier. He hasn't played, you know, like the best PG in the game or anything, but he's played some good defense. He's played some, you know, pretty good offense too. Getting guys open, finding them, and he's knocked down a couple little jumpers as well. Got to get used to his game a little bit more, but he's played pretty well. Nice dribble moves, nice drive. He's short though, so let me pass the ball. Let's get another assist with him. He's blowing past the defenders every single time. We're getting open shots off his passes. Playing well, but definitely not necessarily a score first type of player. But yeah, Migs, I'll show the upgradable badges since we're pretty much done, man. We just passed the two hour mark. We also just gained a new subscriber. Shout out to Retro. Thank you for the sub. Also, welcome to the stream. Ben Pickett, Ben Park, and YBZ. Good to have you boys in the building. Win number 90. I know 17 losses looks kind of bad, but I have gotten a bunch of error codes, so there's my excuse. There's my excuse. Let's take a look at his badges, since Migs asked nicely, what are his upgradable badges? I guess you could get difficult shots to Hall of Fame, Acrobat, 
ankle breaker, pick dodger, tight handles, dimer, downhill. Yeah, so you can't upgrade his badges like... Where are they? You can't upgrade Limitless Spot Up, sadly. I don't think you can update Stop and Go, but... Yeah, I mean, Triple Threat Juke, Downhill... It seems like the super OP badges are the ones that you can't upgrade, but... You can still upgrade some pretty good badges. Ankle Breaker is a pretty good one. Pick Dodger is an important one. Bailout, Tight Handles... Yeah. Downhill's pretty good too. Y'all saw that game we played with him. He was going downhill, man. He was drawing help defense. He was just driving in there really fast. If he could dunk, he would probably be one of the top two or three point guards in the game. But yeah, you guys see that 25 driving dunk. And yeah, of course, six feet tall from Kentucky. He played pretty well in that game though. We got the win and that's all that matters. What's up, Trey Smith? Welcome to the stream. What's up, Joshua? Codeine said, sent you a thumbnail on Twitter. I'll check it out after the stream. Guys, I'm not gonna lie. We might end things right there. I was gonna do a separate stream for Triple Threat Online, so that's why I don't want to grind too much online in this stream. I'll probably grind some online tomorrow, maybe Wednesday. I really haven't thought that far ahead, but we're probably gonna end things right there. Let's end things on this screen right here ladies and gentlemen thank you for watching we still have over 110 people in here i hope you guys have enjoyed the stream and let me go ahead and check out youtube let's go ahead and check out youtube and see who else is live right now i don't know who else is live right now earlier jw he rated me so shout out to him but let's go on youtube and let's actually see who's live so we can show someone some love and raid them Let's go ahead and switch over to YouTube in three, two, one, and boom. All right, so there's me, there's Film Theory. Who's live right now? Let's find out. Oh, so it's just K. Will. My boy K. Will is also streaming the new Triple Threat updates. So yeah, I'm guessing that he's just chilling. Looks like he might be playing draft mode. Whatever he's playing, let's show the guy some love. I've been sub to him for a long time. I'm surprised nobody else is live, man. It's a Monday evening. To be fair, guys have jobs. Some guys are probably busy. Some guys might have school. Let's go ahead and join K. Will's stream real quick. So, you guys join this link. I'm about to spam it like crazy in the chat. You guys join that link. Subscribe to K. Will. Great content. I 100% recommend you subscribe to him. His content's chill, just like mine. Great my team player, great guy. Subscribe to him, drop a like on his stream, and spam in the chat like this. Just like Landon, just like Eugenio, King Ken, just like Landon. Yeah, you guys see what's going on, man. Spam his chat, show him some love, subscribe to him. I promise, man, you'll enjoy his content if you check him out. Yeah, there's Scribble, Dr. Toothbrush, Ben Park, Airball2K, Dallas, Codeine, yeah, we got a lot of guys coming through, so let me go ahead and unmute K. Will, and let's see what he's saying. He said everyone hit that like button. I agree. Make sure to hit that like button for me if you haven't already. He said appreciate the raid. Hey, no problem, K. Will. Let me type that in the chat. No problem, brother. Keep on grinding. About to... Hit the gym, but I'm glad I could catch you. You guys join that link. Show some love to K. Will. Man's got 23 viewers in the stream, and he's getting close to 1.5 thousand subs, so that's a big milestone coming up. You guys subscribe to K. Will, drop a like on the stream, and all those good things, man. All those good things. Hey, thank you guys for coming through. This was a pretty good stream. Definitely a successful stream because we did what we had to do. We got Louis Dampier and I'm glad we could pick up this card. I didn't get Ron Boone, but I had a feeling 2K was going to bless me today and give me something good. So there we go. The spot right here for Ron Boone 
it's sadly empty, but we did it. We got Louis Dampier, and we are going to end things right now. Hey, what's up, Coaster Gaming? Welcome to the stream. You're a little bit late, but what's up, Coaster Gaming? Dallas, Migs, Ben, Hip Hop, everybody who's still hanging around. Thank you for watching. Go check out K Will's stream if you're still in here, though, because I'm about to end. So, yeah, everybody who's still hanging around, thank y'all so much. Y'all take it easy. I hope you enjoyed the stream, and I'll see you again soon. Turn on notifications so you don't miss my next stream or video. I might drop a video tomorrow, but I don't know. Really haven't thought that far ahead. Anyways, I'm sorry. I'm going on and on. You guys have a good night, man. Or morning, afternoon, wherever it is you're at. Take it easy, and I'll see you again soon.